Hi, I'm Matthew Pekovic from Matt's Movie Reviews, and this is my review of Captain America The Winter Soldier. So far, the Phase 2 set of Marvel superhero movies haven't gone off to a great start, with Iron Man 3 and 4 The Dark World failing to recapture the excitement and spirit that the Phase 1 films had. How fitting then that the Star Spangled Adventure himself, Captain America, has come to save the day, with every element in Captain America The Winter Soldier, from its strong characters, engrossing conspiracy storyline, and especially the excellent action scenes, all brilliantly done. Chris Evans returns as Steve Rogers, aka Captain America, who after 60 years in suspended animation is still struggling to catch up with the current world. When global espionage agency SHIELD is compromised, Rogers' search for an unknown enemy leads him to the mysterious super assassin known as the Winter Soldier, played by Sebastian Stan. Captain America the Winter Soldier is as much a conspiracy thriller as it is a comic book movie. The film revolves around the concept of fear versus freedom, where even Captain America, a symbol of liberty, courage and strength, struggles to get a handle of who is on the side of right and wrong in a morally mixed up world that's open to the infiltration of evil. Performances wise, everyone brings their A game. Evans simply owns the role of Captain America. Scarlett Johansson and Samuel Jackson do not coast in the recurring roles of Black Widow and S.H.I.E.L.D. leader Nick Fury. In new addition, Anthony Mackie delivers sharp quips and high flying action as winged hero Falcon. Meanwhile, Sebastian Stan plays an intimidating adversary as the Winter Soldier, who in strength and skill is equal to the good captain. Then there is the interesting addition of Robert Redford, who adds a gravitas to the film and gives more credence to the conspiracy thriller aspect since he starred in one of the greatest conspiracy thrillers of all time in Order President's Men. Best of all are the tense, tight and terrific action sequences. Amazingly, directors Anthony and Joe Russo have no experience with the action genre, having come from the land of TV comedy we have shows such as Arrested Development and Community. Yet here the pair have made something gritty, provocative and epic. If a comparison were to be made, it wouldn't be with another Marvel comic movie, but with Christopher Nolan's Dark Knight trilogy, since both projects are rich in theme, visuals and character. In other words, Captain America The Winter Soldier is a bloody brilliant superhero movie.